What's going on everybody? Welcome back to another video. Today we'll be looking at a classic Lego set that was released earlier this year. This is called the Lego Bonsai Tree from Lego Ideas. And uh, I've got to say, this was one of this was a really nice looking build. It's essentially a tree, you know, small little tree build. And uh, nothing uh, too special for that, but the whole point of this is for the aesthetics. It's not meant to be a playset. And it's, it's just here for the wow factor, and boy does it deliver. Presentation is key in sets like these, and they sure do have it here. The, st the little pot the tree is sitting in is very nice. It has like that, that little, um, st that little good, what's it called? Color of uh, black. And at the very bottom, they use these uh, car tire, car tire pieces to like hold the thing up. So in fact, the bottom is actually quite smooth. It actually has like sauce. It's not like a rough Lego piece like this. More like, I don't know what's the best way to ex explain it, but in terms of friction, it creates stability. So it's not like gonna be like moving around a lot. So that's pretty good. The tree itself, uh, very nice. Got the nice leaves. Details and, and of course they do include a cherry blossom variant, which I have not done yet And you may also notice wait you're missing something important That's right in the pot of this tree There's supposed to be dirt and I felt like it would be cool if I didn't pour the dirt in And I did it during this video, and so that's exactly what we're gonna do So there's like I believe there was like four bags. No five bags Bag number three here was what had the dirt pieces that so we're gonna Crack this open. Ugh. Okay. So I believe this dirt is for the cherry blossom version, and then this dirt is your standard one. I've actually is it? Hold on, let me see. Yep, yep, yep. Okay. All right, let's pour this in. So this, I will save this for the cherry blossom variant. So we're supposed to just dump it in, do the side like this, kind of just reenacting like real dirt, because these are. This is a Japanese tree. The tree found in Japan, and it, I believe they, the color of the dirt is like a little bit different. So I'm just gonna spread this evenly throughout the build. Oh, and the whole tree fell apart in the process. All right, I've sorted the things out. The dirt is in, as you can see. It's all right here, very nice. It's just all little tile pieces, so nothing too significant there. Um, as for the rest of the tree, really like how they use these uh, whip, whipping whiplash pieces to act as tree roots just to wrap around and give it some more uh, texture. Also the uh, tree trunk here has like a nice curve and at the very end they've got the, this, this horse, I believe this is a horse tail. So uh, that's uh, pretty epic. So I will say um, overall the entire tree, there's really not much to say, it's like a mini, it's like a thing to just display it's not really it's also supposed to show anything significant but I figured just pouring that dirt will give this video some you know some some more uh, interesting feel to it instead of just looking at this, this plain old tree so um I give this the standard one before we look at cher the cherry blossom one I give this a overall uh, a 9 out of 10 aesthetics is good and I think yeah, well, I'll give my final, final thoughts after uh, after we look at the cherry blossom variant. But uh, yeah, it should be uh, should be it. So this is the uh, the default, the normal one. So now we're going to put this aside, take apart the leaves, and then we're going to take bag number five here of all the cherry blossom parts, and then uh, slap that on there. Well, interestingly enough, there's a lot of frogs, lots of frog pieces. So this should be interesting, and as well as the dirt. So this should be really interesting. All right, ladies and gentlemen, here is the cherry blossom variant. And you may have noticed I have, did not include this little stand in the beginning. So I just wanted to show you this tree first, and I think it'll look better with the stand. So here's what this, here's what the bottom stand looks like, all nicely built. So I think that looks pretty solid. It's not, it doesn't look bad whatsoever. I think this would be a, a pretty cool addition as a design for buildings or something maybe as a prison prison cell but we'll see so the idea is you just you just put this on there's enough friction to hold it steady so i don't have to shake a ton unless i really put force into it then the, only then it will start to fall off but other than that it, it's it stays on pretty solidly so 
like I said, for the cherry blossom uh, variant, there is a lot of pink frogs on it. A lot of pink frogs. Will I say it's too much of a, of a hassle? I think that's a very creative on the designer's part. I think it makes the overall tree look a lot cooler, a lot prettier, and also it's, it's an interesting piece choice for sure, but it, it changes the texture of it for sure. That, that's that's one, one thing for sure. So, ultimately, uh, it's, I don't really necessarily think this is the best. I still think the default variant is a little better, but this still looks pretty nice. So, I don't know. Oh yeah, and the dirt has changed. The dirt is a little different. But yeah, no, um, yeah, so I, overall, this tree could, could use a little bit of improvements, but I think other than that, it's a pretty decent looking bonsai tree. Definitely one of the stronger sets that I've seen in terms of nature-like sets. This is a pretty decent variant, so, I'm, you know, I'm thinking I might use this one for the thumbnail instead of the default variant, so... All right, let's wrap up the review. So overall, what do I think? Yeah, I returned it back to it, its normal default because uh, if I had to pick between this or the cherry blossom, I would definitely think this one is my f better. This one's better than the cherry blossom. This is just my opinions because I personally think simplicity is better. I really didn't. I like the creativity of using the frog pieces for the cherry blossom one, but it just wasn't. It just wasn't my thing. I think this is, this looked a lot better. Now, we need to talk about price, because this thing is 80 bucks for something this small. <sighs> Lego, that's brutal. I like this set, but it's just so expensive. Why? Make it 50 if you're going to charge something like this. It's $80 for something this small. I understand it was 40 or 50 It definitely needs to cut by half. The price just seems a little bit too ridiculous on this thing. So, like, that that really that really screwed me over. That's why I waited till a discount, I waited till a sale to get this. I didn't get this on release day, because I looked at the price, I'm just like, Jesus Christ, that is just not worth it. So, got this at a discount. Glad I did. Even on a discount, it was like $60, $50. Still a little bit on the expensive side, I really think. So, overall, this entire set, it ain't so bad. I will say though, for the price, it's a little bit expensive. Uh, looking at the box here and then just seeing the, you know, just how much content you get in this box, and then just yeah, it's 80 bucks. I, I don't know. The price just could be improved a little bit. And then just to show you the back, there you go. I do like the two variants, but if this was a little cheaper. That would definitely make it a lot better. So, with that being said, that's uh, pretty much it for this review. For this set, you can go pick it up yourself. I don't even know what category this fits in, but this is the bonsai tree. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to hit that like button and subscribe to the channel for more. That is it for this one, and we'll see you in the next one. Talk to you again later. Bye for now.